Uh, I want to. I want. I know it was previously uh, the "When I See You" diss. Did you expect that? Or let me ask you this: Would you consider that one of the all-time best diss songs or diss responses, or however you want to call it? Yeah, that bit went up. I knew it was gonna go up when I recorded it. The diss records and and I I wanna because you you just posted a picture recently, right? You you went to somebody's friend's grave site yeah. cemetery whatever um when you do those things are you ever worried about karma or you know what i'm saying shit like that no not really i already i ain't never really seen something i ain't really been through already so even if something do happen it's regular to me type shit um, it's the life i live type shit you ever worry about the backlash that be coming with like shit like that Nah, they gonna talk regardless. They gonna say what they, they gonna troll regardless. They gonna say what they wanna say regardless. You got troll back? Hmm? You got troll back? Nah, shit, I'm just do what I do. I'm gonna be Fulio and pop my shit back. But I ain't gonna, I don't know. There you go. Like, I think Fulio embraced, like, that that Dark night image. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes being okay with being the bad guy in certain situations. We know that. We know yeah, that. Exactly. Do you embrace that role? Like the, you know what I'm saying? Because you've done multiple interviews where you've been like, "Yeah, I'm the most hated." You know what I'm saying? Do you embrace that at this point? Now, clearly, he said he don't give a fuck. In my city, like, yeah, we don't really, we ain't really too cool with no people like no side of town. Now, so that shit regular with us. Like, we've been the most hated. So in my city, but as far as like worldwide, like, I get love everywhere <laughs> I go. But in my city, that shit over with. Yeah, I think I respect you a lot because that me and him done talked before about how we feel about certain artists and like when your name come up, I always mention how I just respect how you kind of just okay with standing, not alone, you got your people, yeah. but you stand on your own team, like you don't really be worried about clicking up with this group or this person or trying to be cool with them or trying to bring somebody else into your situation, even when you had the Kodak situation. Yeah. Like you don't be trying to tag nobody in, you just handle your business. And it's like, I just feel like that's why I kind of respect you a little bit more than certain artists because you really just be standing with your people and yeah, you rock then, out. Then, like, the industry, this shit kind of weird. Ever since, like, I kind of got my foot in the door, this shit, I just see what go on, like, how nigga dead ride, how they click up. So I ain't never been the type to, like, run to another rapper to help me with a beef or a click up or none of that. I just, me and my brothers, who I grew up with. Mm-hmm. 